Hi everyone, I'm John Glasscock, and welcome back to another tips and tricks video for your PlayStation. In today's video, I'm going to show you what I recommend to do if your PlayStation 4 won't accept or eject game discs. Now, this is a fairly common issue with a lot of PS4 consoles, but luckily there is an easy fix. Before we get started, if you could make sure to leave a like rating on the video for good luck and comment below if this has ever happened to you, I'd be very interested to know. So the first thing that you can try is either inserting or ejecting the disc while the PlayStation is vertical. Make sure that the PlayStation is completely off and then place your console in the vertical position. Now turn the PlayStation back on and attempt to either insert or eject the game disc. Remember that it's extremely important to be extra careful when doing this because you do not want to move the system around while it's powered on, especially if there's a game disc stuck inside. So attempt these steps at your own risk. If this fixes your issue, then just make sure to turn the system completely off before you move the console back to its original position. The next thing that you can try is using the secret screw on on the system to manually eject or recalibrate the disk drive. The location of the screw really depends on which system that you have, but you can usually find it by either looking under the console or removing the cover for the hard drive. If you're having trouble finding it, I'll leave a link to the PlayStation website in the description that shows you its exact location for every PlayStation model number. First, you'll want to make sure that all cables are disconnected from the system, then place the console on a flat surface, and then use a long Phillips head screwdriver to turn the screw and release the disk. So as you can see on my PS4 Pro, turning counterclockwise ejects the disc and clockwise brings the disc back in. Now if you have a launch edition PS4, be extra careful not to press down on the screw too hard, otherwise it'll just keep spinning and it won't actually eject the disc. Patience and being gentle is the key. But if you need additional information, you can refer to the link in the description to the PlayStation website. Now a little trick that I learned is a method that sort of recalibrates the disc drive, but I only recommend doing this when there is no disc inside the system. All that you gotta do is just give the screw a few turns in both directions. Sometimes if your PlayStation 4 just won't take discs, this can a lot of times fix the issue. Once again, I do not recommend attempting this while there's a disc already inside the system, otherwise you might hear a clicking noise. But once finished, you can power the system back on and everything should operate as normal. If you have any further issues or concerns, I recommend that you contact Sony support or check your user guide for a solution. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and found it useful or at least interesting, and if you did, make sure to leave a like rating on the video, comment below to let me know what you think, and as always, don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell for post notifications. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.